Hello and welcome to our video for USB hosting on the new Sony Xperia Z Ultra. USB hosting is a great little feature that allows you to connect certain USB peripherals. Now I have got here a USB host cable. This is a Samsung model, although you can use any model. And I'm gonna connect that straight into the micro USB port on the side of the Z Ultra up here on the top left. So let's just pop that in quickly. Other way around, third way around, as we all know, USB cables exist in three dimensions. Right, nothing will pop up on the screen yet until we connect something. So, little USB pen drive. Let's just pop that in here. And USB storage connected comes straight up. So, we can go into settings and take a look down at storage. Straight away, it's picked up that there's a two gig USB stick connected. You can unmount there to safely remove. You can clear and erase everything, which I'm not gonna do right now. And using, I've got File Commander installed on here as a uh, file navigator. You can go through as internal storage, external storage, and straight away we can see what's been installed on there. Let's have a quick play of a video, so I can play back a video that we've got installed on the USB stick. It's our funky new Clove intro video. Um, not just USB pens, memory sticks as well. Um, and memory cards, so I'm going to plug in an external card reader. I'm being warned here because I didn't safely remove. Um, <laughs> as you should do at all times. Uh, so, USB card reader attached. Let's put in a micro SD card here. Other way around, everything's going in the wrong way today. And preparing, connected, just like last time. And if I go back into File Manager, oh, I've been updated. My external storage is updated with new information. Camera, some images taken from wherever that card was installed. Videos, which one's that? One of our mobile how-to videos. So, reading information directly from there. USB hubs are also supported. I'm going to go through the correct way of uh, uninstalling that this time. Storage, unmount. There we go. Now it's been removed. Me being safe. And USB hub, three on there. The device will only recognize the first USB storage device that you install. So if I go and put this memory card in, sorry, this USB stick in, and then go and put in my card reader. My setting screen has updated only with the first to be plugged in. So one at a time, please people. Uh, USB hosting is also how you'll go about running a PlayStation 3 controller on the Z Ultra and other new Xperia devices. If we go into our settings, let's just close the flap there. Go into settings, you can see Xperia connectivity, DualShock Wireless 3 controller. So if you do exactly the same process and attach using a USB host cable, a DualShock 3, you'll pair that up. Um, and it, as soon as you've connected them, this will be unghosted, you can tap next, you'll be able to connect it up. That will change the default on that particular DualShock 3 controller to this phone. So if you, it will no longer be paired by Bluetooth to your PS3 console. So if you press the central button that would normally turn on the console, that won't work. It will now be paired up to this phone. Um, you can swap it back, of course, by connecting it up via USB cable. So the DualShock 3 can be repaired with any device or console with the with the cable. Thanks for watching our USB hosting video.